What's going on you guys? It is Wanny back on your screen bringing you a brand new video in Greenville, Wisconsin. If you are new here, make sure to smash the subscribe button down below to join the Wanny family today. And today we have been on call here at the fire station working as an EMS driver you guys. So it seems like we just got a call right now. We better check in with our boss and see what is happening. We need to grab our uniform and we need to get going as soon as possible. Hey boss, we just got a call right now. Did you see what happened? Oh my goodness, apparently a grandma fell down the stairs and hit her head. We need to go right now. Let's go. This can be very, very serious. So let's get on the road right now, you guys, and let's head to the Six Houses neighborhood. We need to get going as soon as possible, you guys. Seriously, the caller seemed very distressed and he was very, very worried about his wife. So we're going to get over there as soon as possible and we're going to make sure she is just fine. You know, these people have lived in this house for over 50 years and he said that these stairs are really really steep and she just fell down them all so I'm really worried but we're gonna get there as soon as we can and we are going to save the day and make sure she is just fine you guys all right here we are at the neighborhood right now we're gonna be pulling up in just a second and we are going to be finding the house with the pink Mercedes on the driveway that is literally what they told us to look out for but I think it is right up here you guys so thank goodness we are here right now and we are going to save the day so here we are here we are Oh my goodness, guys, I cannot believe this. Guys, my coworker is pulling up right now and he is gonna have to get the stretcher for us. Hey there, sir, how are you doing today? It is great to see ya. Oh my goodness, okay, we just got the call about your wife. She fell down the stairs. We are gonna get her on the stretcher right now and we're gonna get her to the emergency room as soon as possible. All right, ma'am, are you doing okay? Are you doing okay? All right, ma'am, you're gonna be just fine. Can you hear me? All right, ma'am, let's get you on the stretcher right now. You're going to be just fine. I think it's just a minor fall, but we want you to get checked out by the doctors. All right, sir, you can follow behind to the emergency room. It seems like she should be okay, but you just never know, sir, okay? So let's get going right now to the emergency room. She's getting loaded up in the ambulance right now, and we are going to get to the hospital immediately, guys. So here we are right now, and we are going to get going immediately. Let's go. We need all units to the emergency room right now. We have a grandma that has fallen down the stairs and we need doctors there immediately ready to take care of this patient so we are rolling on the road right now we'll be arriving at the emergency room in just a few minutes to make sure that this grandma gets the care that she needs because she seems to be very very injured she could have broken a bone and she could have hit her head very very hard so they're gonna have to check her out make sure that everything is okay and she should be just fine but you just never know until the doctors check everything out you guys so we're pulling up there in just a second we're getting there as soon as we can because time is of the essence you guys it's not good so here we are right now at the emergency room we're gonna get her inside in just a moment and the doctors are going to be taking care of her all right guys here we are right now all right ma'am let's get you on the stretcher right now we're gonna get you inside and we are gonna get you taken care of as soon as possible all right hi there doctor how you doing today uh we got a patient here she fell down the stairs and it was quite the fall so you need to check her out immediately okay all right, we're going to get her into emergency room nine right now, and she is going to be just fine. All right, here we are. Don't worry, ma'am. You're going to be just fine, okay? All right, here we go. We got to get her in the bed right now. All right, well, thank you so much, doctor. We appreciate you taking the time to get out here as soon as possible. Sir, you'll be just fine, and if you need anything, let us know, okay? All right, guys, we're getting back on the road in just a second. It seems like we literally have another call right now. Apparently, there is a whole entire family at this billboard because their kids literally decided to climb all the way to the top, you guys. So let's go right now. I'm actually a little bit nervous about this call. You know, this billboard is about... 40 feet in the air you guys so we're gonna have to climb all the way to the top to save the children and get them down as soon as possible so we are gonna be getting out of here right now we're gonna be getting on the main highway in just a few minutes you guys it does not seem like there's any injuries but of course we need ems and fire department to go out there to make sure that we get them down safely and quickly because we do not want those parents climbing up this billboard if you make one wrong move you could literally fall down you guys which is extremely dangerous so we are rolling down the road right now we'll be arriving at the scene in just a few minutes thank goodness we got the tall fire truck here we might have to climb up there and we are going to have to get these children down because guys let me tell you this is quite the billboard it is so tall in the sky you guys i cannot believe 
these kids thought to do this, okay? I mean, it is actually crazy. Guys, it is actually crazy. So we're going to get down there right now, and we are going to save these children. Hopefully, they're okay. I'm sure the parents are extremely worried about them, but I'm sure we'll get them down just fine, you guys. We have had many calls like this in the past, so I think they'll be just fine. All right, here we are. We're pulling up in just a second. I see the billboard, and I see a vehicle under, and I see some people jumping up and down. So I'm sure this is them right now. Oh my goodness, you guys. There is literally children dump, jumping up and down over here. Are you kidding me? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Are you guys okay? Oh my goodness. Help us. We are on vacation and our kids got stuck on top of the billboard. Are you serious? Guys, calm down up there. Calm down, okay? Stand still. Stand still, okay? All right, we need to get up there right now and we got to get these children down. How did they possibly get up here? Are you kidding me? Are you serious? Okay, you probably need to watch your children a little bit closer if they're climbing billboards, okay? My coworker is climbing up there right now. He's going to get them down as soon as possible. It's okay, you guys. You're going to be just fine. Do not worry. Do not worry, okay? All right, guys. Slowly head to the ladder. I got um, some rope just in case they need it. But, guys, it seems like they'll be just fine. All right, they're getting down right now, you guys. Slowly but surely. Take your time, okay? Take your time. You'll be just fine. As you guys can see, they're getting down right now. They'll be just fine, okay? All right, good job, you guys. I'm glad that you're okay, and you guys did a great job staying calm and climbing down. So it is okay. Please make sure that you guys do not climb any more billboards, okay? Because it is quite the height. That is 40 feet in the air, okay? Be careful and stay safe. If you need anything, please let us know, okay? All right, that was crazy, guys. I honestly cannot believe it. Seriously, unbelievable. All right, you guys. Seems like we got another call right now. Oh, my goodness. There is a major car accident at the airport. Apparently, people were racing old vintage vehicles, and they got into a humongous accident, you guys. Apparently, the car is on fire right now, so we need to get down there as soon as possible and make sure that everything is okay. It is not looking good. Apparently, one of these old vehicles has a huge engine fire and it has spread into the other vehicle so we don't know how bad it is we just got the call right now so we are roaring down the road as fast as we can to get to the airport and make sure that everybody is okay oh my goodness guys what a crazy day it has been honestly we've had call after call after call and it has been insane so we're pulling up to the airport right now and we are going to make sure that these People get the help that they need. Hopefully the vehicles can be put out quickly because guys, if we do not get this fire put out, it could lead to an explosion and that is definitely not what we want to happen. So here we are at the airport right now. We are going to be looking for this car accident and hoping that we could get everybody saved as soon as possible, guys. I am so scared right now. Okay, here we are. Here we are. I see the vehicles already. There it is. Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me right now? Oh my goodness, guys. This is unbelievable. Are you guys okay? Are you guys okay? Oh my goodness, guys. Look at this. The vehicle is literally on fire, guys. We need to get you in the ambulance right now. Let me grab the stretcher. You guys are going to be just fine, okay? Deep breaths, deep breaths. Okay, here we go. Got the stretcher right now. All right, let me help you up right now. All right, so you're going to be just fine. Here we go. Let's get you on the stretcher right now. You're going to be okay, okay? Here we go. We're getting you in the ambulance right now, sir. Do not worry. Do not worry at all. All right, we're getting you in the back of the ambulance right now. Oh, my goodness. You're going to be just fine, sir. Do not worry. Do not worry at all, okay? Get in the ambulance right now, and we'll get you to the emergency room. All right, we got his friend as well. Thank you so much. We need to get this fire put out as soon as possible because this old vehicle can literally explode oh my goodness guys this is not good at all i honestly cannot believe this is happening right now but we got our crew over here right now and he is going to be putting out this fire as soon as possible oh my goodness all right i'm gonna go to the emergency room right now get these two dropped off you guys okay back there you're gonna be okay do not worry do not worry it seems like they literally were going so fast down this drag strip that they literally crashed into each other i have no idea how fast they were going but it seems like they were very very injured so we're gonna get to the emergency room as soon as possible and we are gonna make sure that these two are okay you guys i honestly 
cannot believe that they even put in this drag strip because we literally get so many calls about car accidents here it is quite dangerous you guys so we got to be careful and we got to get these two to the emergency room as soon as possible because their injuries are very very bad they're literally um some fire on them and it is not good you guys they are lucky that we got there in time because that vehicle could have literally exploded and caused major major damage so we're gonna get on the back road right now we'll be arriving at the emergency room in about 10 minutes and we're gonna get the doctors taken care of these two as soon as possible thank goodness we got the fire truck out there quickly you guys because let me tell you it could have got very very bad so we're going down these back roads as fast as we can but as you guys can see they literally do not even plow these back roads it is unbelievable you guys it is absolutely unbelievable you know we got to be careful because if we go too fast we literally could lose control and we do not need another car accident so we got to be careful but we got to get these two to the emergency room as soon as possible guys so we're getting down there and we already let the doctors know that we are on the way with two more patients i'm just hoping that that grandma is okay hopefully she is recovered and she's probably going to be going home very very soon all right you guys i am ready to get to the emergency room right now oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh you guys we literally almost lost control that was not good at all okay we're okay we're okay guys i told you these back roads are literally not even plowed so it is actually insane you guys we literally almost lost control that would have been so bad seriously could you imagine if we crashed with the patients in the back that would have been horrible all right here we are we're pulling up to the emergency room in just a second you guys and we're gonna get these two in the hospital right now it seems like we have been working for every guys this shift has already been over 10 hours long but there is nobody else on duty to help with these calls so we're gonna be working for quite a while today you guys so we are finally back at the emergency room right now all right guys let's get you on the stretcher right now and let's get you in the emergency room as soon as possible all right sir you're gonna be just fine do not worry do not worry oh my goodness hi there doctor uh it seems like we got another patient here for you he was in a bad car accident okay let's get him to room six all right let's go room six you guys we're gonna get you in there as soon as possible and the doctor's gonna take care of you okay all right room six is right down here all right do not worry sir do not worry the doctor's gonna take good care of you all right here we are right now all right i gotta get the other patient from the ambulance right now and the doctor is gonna be taking care of them as soon as he can all right seems like grandpa is still here at the emergency room so hopefully everything is okay all right sir let's get you on the stretcher right now and get you inside the emergency room you're gonna be just fine do not worry deep breaths i know that was a bad car accident but you know the doctors are waiting for you and they're gonna get everything taken care of it's okay sir stay calm deep breaths deep breaths i know you're gonna be just fine do not worry all right we're gonna get you in room six as well and the doctor is gonna take care of you all right here we are sir all right well doctor thank you so much thank you thank you all right sir you're gonna be okay do not worry do not worry the doctor's gonna take good care of you thank you doctor we'll probably be back later on okay oh brother guys are you kidding me right now we got one more call today it seems like that station restaurant is on fire right down the road so we're gonna have to get everybody evacuated and make sure everybody's okay is your wife doing okay sir is everything going okay i hope everything is because you have been here for quite a while oh my goodness all right well i'll be back later on but if you need anything let me know okay sir oh my gosh there she is hi there are you doing okay oh my goodness we are so glad you're doing better thank goodness i was really worried about you oh my goodness all right well you two take care and please be careful out there okay all right guys we're gonna be getting back in the ambulance right now we're gonna be headed to the station restaurant i hope my coworker is already there right now i'm um, handling this gigantic fire but let me tell you guys this is literally one of the busiest restaurants in all of greenville so there is so many customers always here so i'm sure there is going to be a lot of people evacuating the building as soon as we get there so we're pulling up right now you guys and we are finally here right now oh my goodness guys the crew is already here right now getting this fire put out is everybody okay are you guys okay over here anybody need emergency assistance okay oh my goodness guys seems like they had a bad kitchen fire so let's see oh my gosh as you guys can see the alarm is still going off right now but we are going to make sure everything is good and everyone's evacuated thank goodness you got here as soon as possible because this was going to be really bad if we didn't so 
We're really lucky everybody got out okay and there are no injuries, thank goodness. All right, you guys. Well, you guys need to leave the scene, please, because the restaurant is closed, unfortunately. I'm so sorry. It seems like you won't be getting your dinner this evening, but thank goodness our crew was able to get here as soon as possible. So, what a crazy day it has been here working as an ambulance driver, you guys. We literally had so many calls throughout the day, and it was non-stop. We literally did not even get one single lunch break today. So, we're going to be pulling up at the station in just a few more minutes, and I think think I need to get some rest you guys because I am literally so exhausted from all of these calls so oh my goodness guys what a day look at our ambulance it is literally filthy from all the calls that we have been through today I mean it has been absolutely insane so we are gonna get some snacks here from the vending machine we are gonna be relaxing a little bit we got our uniform off and we are gonna be headed back to the cafeteria to get some food guys because I am really really hungry hopefully they got some snacks over here Ooh, they got us some donuts those are really really good all right well it has been a crazy day here in Greenville Wisconsin I hope that you guys did enjoy this EMS rescue video if you guys did make sure you guys drop a like leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe to join the Wanny family today if you made it to the end of the video you are awesome and we will see you in the next one bye everybody